Hello Mantra Beauty fam, my name is Sushmita and today I'll be creating this wedding guest makeup look. This is the wedding season and I thought you guys will get a lot of invites to different weddings and I thought this will be a really helpful video. I wore this makeup look in one of the weddings that I attended. I just posted a story of this makeup look on my Instagram and everybody wanted a tutorial on this. So now let's get started. Okay guys, so first of all I'm gonna use a primer and I'm gonna use the Maybelline Fit Me Dewy Smooth Primer. I want my face to be glowy and dewy. I am just just going to take the primer and apply it all over my face and this primer gives a very glowy dewy finish to the face okay so look at my face right now it is so shiny Mintra has added the beauty section recently and it's got a variety of brands to shop from I shopped all my products in this video from Mintra Beauty and all the links will be mentioned in the description box below now I'm using the Mama Earth Glow Serum Foundation I'm in the shade Nude Glow and I'm just going to take a pump of this foundation on my hand just taking a little bit at a time if I need more I'll add more and I'm just going to dab it all over my face this foundation gives a very glowy dewy finish it just blends so easily it's a medium coverage foundation and I love the finish of it it just looks like your skin but better and it just gives such a glowy dewy finish to the skin for the concealer i'm gonna use the smashbox studio skin flawless 24 hour concealer i'm in the shade medium warm golden i'm gonna apply the concealer on my under eye area if you want you can use a brush but i prefer using fingers for the concealer because the warmth of my fingers it just helps melt the product beautifully this concealer has a medium to full coverage it just gives a beautiful coverage to the under eye area it just looks like you didn't have dark circles at all it's a light weight concealer and it just gives a full coverage it's just absolutely stunning now with the help of the mama earth glow mattifying loose powder i'm just going to set my under eye area i'm just going to pick some powder and apply it in my under eye area push the product in with the help of the brush and this powder it just gives such an airbrush finish it's just absolutely amazing and it looks like this area is airbrushed use the brush very very lightly don't be too harsh on your under eye area or on your skin the application of the makeup should be very very light-handed you can also set the other areas of your face like around your mouth if you want or where you see that there's too much shine or too much oil and this powder it's not like mattifying mattifying it's crazy how it sets the face and at the same time imparts a beautiful beautiful glow to the face for my eyebrows i'm just going to use the product that i always always use it's the sugar arch arrival brow definer this is in the shade felix onyx i'm just going to fill in my brows wherever there are gaps i'm just going to fill in i'm not going to change the shape or anything and it's so easy to fill in the gaps with this eyebrow pencil i've never liked any other eyebrow product as much as i like this one it hardly took me 10 seconds to fill in both my eyebrows next to set my brows i'm gonna use the benefit gimme brow i love this to set my eyebrow hair and once it's set it's not gonna budge next i'm gonna move on to contour blush and highlight for that i'm gonna use the sugar contour d force face palette in the shade subtle summit so i'm gonna use this contour shade first it's a cool toned contour shade and I'm just going to start contouring my face fill in the hollows of my cheekbones I love how beautiful the contour is it's very pigmented so be very very careful when you pick up the product we're going for a soft look and just going to contour the jawline and I'm also going to contour the sides of my nose next I'm gonna apply the blush this is a very soft blush look how beautiful the shade is it just instantly makes your face look very fresh and very youthful just a little bit on the top of my nose and next I'm also going to use the highlighter and highlight the high points of my face oh my god just look at that highlighter just look at the glow and this side of my face I mean wow I'm also going to apply it on the bridge of my nose Cupid's bow and chin 
and just a little bit on the middle of my forehead. I'll also apply it on my brow bone area and I'm also going to apply it in the inner corners of my eyes and it just opens up the eye. Guys, you can shop all these products now just check out the description box i'll mention all the product links there for my eyes i'm going to use the faces canada ultimate pro eyeshadow palette this is in the shade glimmer for my crease area i'm going to use this brown shade the palette is amazing it's got all these beautiful shades and it's like really really pigmented all the shades i'll just swatch a couple for you guys so that you'll know how beautiful the palette is look at that stunning shade all the shades in this palette they're just absolutely gorgeous if you want to shop this palette you can just go check out the link in the description box i'm just going to take this brown shade and apply it in the crease of my eyes it's just so pigmented you just have to use the tiniest amount and it's done look how beautifully it blends and the shades are super buttery and they look gorgeous. Next shade I'm going to use all over my eyelids is this pink shiny shade. Okay, for that I'm going to use my fingers. I'll just pick that shade, apply it all over my eyelids. I mean, look at that beautiful shine. I'm going to apply it on my other eyelid also. It just creates a very soft glam look. Now we're going to apply a third shade. I'm going to use this bronze shade on the outer corners of my eyes and just put the maximum product on the outer corners. Like I'm just concentrating on putting the maximum color on the outer corners of my eyes right now. And I'm going to blend it a little later so once i'm happy with the concentration of the color i'm just going to blend it now taking the brush with no extra color in it i'm just going to blend the edges also taking the small brush that comes with the palette i'm just going to pick the same bronze shade that i just applied on the outer corners of my eyes just going to apply it on my lower lash line and connect it with the outer corners of my eyes. The eye look is very, very simple. I'm done with my eyes. For the mascara, I'm going to use the Maybelline Colossal Waterproof Mascara. And I'm going to apply it on my upper lashes and also on my lower lash line. Next, for lipstick, I'm going to use the MAC Matte Lipstick in the shade Velvet Teddy. And again, this is one of my favorite uh, shades. It's beautiful it's absolutely stunning it's an everyday shade and you can also wear it on special occasions it's just so versatile it's such a beautiful peachy brown shade just looks stunning if you want to buy this beautiful lipstick shade which i think that every girl should own one you can just check out the link in the description box below. I've mentioned all the links to the products down below. You can go shop whatever you want. Alright guys, my look is complete now. I hope you enjoyed watching this tutorial and I hope you recreate this look. And if you want to buy any product, you can just check the description box below. I've mentioned all the product links in the description box below. Like this video, share it with your friends and subscribe to Mintra's YouTube channel for more such amazing content. Bye!